Hey, Heidi Ho neighbor. Guess what we got today? I'm going to show you the proper way of cleaning a turkey before you throw it in the pan and before you throw it in the oven. Okay. Actually, there's not really a real trick to this, but you do want your turkey to be cleaned. Okay. A lot of people don't know this. So that's why I'm showing you this today. Me and Judy decided we wanted to have a turkey. So now we're having one. First thing is you want to have it in cold water and you want to thaw out your turkey. When you, when you first buy a turkey, that baby's real solid. So you want to let it sit in your refrigerator for at least three days, maybe four, depending on how big it is. We just got a little 10 pounder here. And uh, it, this sat out for four days. Yeah, and it's nice and thawed out for us now. But anyways, what you want to do is, first thing you want to do, you want to get rid of that plastic thing and it holds it all together and all that kind of stuff. Okay, turn on your cold water, and with your hand, and I'm going to assume that your hands are clean, you want to rub this. You want to rub the breast, the legs, the thighs. Let the water run on there. The wings. See, there's some dirt right there. Yeah. You know, you don't want all that uh, garbage on there. And of course, you take out the innards and all that stuff. And make sure that where the neck is, there's going to be a cavity right here. You want to make sure that it's open. Okay? So you can run the, run the water right in there. Watch it out the inside of your turkey. And of course, flip it over. Some people, they leave, they leave the... Uh, Part that jumps over the fence on there. Me, I do not. So we're just gonna cut that right off of there and toss that right there. And of course some people don't like this extra fat. You can pull that right off of there. Then you want to check, check, make sure that the lungs, the heart, all that is out of here. Okay. And you're going to want to, this is what you're going to want to rinse out, especially good. The inside. Yes, that water is very, very cold, but it's very important that you do that. Make sure, see where this is here? They have that, all that black liver. This is where all that sits in there. You don't want that in there. You're gonna, you wanna, you're gonna wanna flush your bird out a couple times. So it's nice and clean in there. You don't want all that stuff in there. And you're gonna check your neck hole. See now, she's just coming right through there. That's what we want. Stick it over a little bit more. No, I'm not going to tell you how to cook it because everybody has their different ways of cooking a turkey. Judy is going to cook it her way. Of course, I would do it my way. But just want to make sure all that blood, that plastic flavor, is off of there. You know, you cut it out of that plastic bag. The turkey's been sitting in there a while. And that's all there is to it. You want to make sure that turkey is nice and clean. Or a 
my little feathers off of there. I mean, you don't have to be perfect, perfect, but look how nice that looks now. It actually looks like a nice clean piece of meat. Look at that. The inside, see how the inside, can you see that? I don't know if you can or not, but if you looked inside there, see how nice and clean that is? You want to rinse that, especially the inside. Especially the inside. The lungs are out, there's no heart, nothing. People, that's what you want. That's a proper way to clean, clean a turkey from the store. So, with that in mind, enjoy your dinner. Because I'm going to enjoy this after Judy gets done with it. And subscribe to my channel because you're going to learn a lot this year. Because I am too. Hey, you all take care. Bye bye then.